honest with you, your, your sister Lauren. Yes, I'm aware of her name. Right. Uh, she, she said, well, her husband Kevin said that you were really cute and, and that I would be an absolute moron to pass this up, so I decided to take a risk and listen to him. And what about you? Lauren said you look like Brad Pitt. So, do you agree with Kevin? About what? Am I really cute? What? You can't ask me that. Why not? You said you're an open book. Well, am I? She's a little artsy. She's hip and cool. She's just like all those girls that ignored me all through school. First impression. I can be totally wrong. It's only a first impression. And maybe she's a stumpy and conservative way up tight girl who's still a virgin. Never goes past second base, suppressing every single urge until she marches down the aisle and finally ties the knot. She can want a giant family, be an opera devotee, hell, even have a PhD. Yes, that's who she could be. I'm waiting. Yes, you are very pleasant looking. Pleasant looking. Stunning, gorgeous, incredibly desirable. D, all of the above. Oh, and what adjectives would you use to describe me? He's a bit annoying and overdressed. He's got the kind of eye that says, look at me, I'm stressed. Uh, really, there are so many adjectives to choose from. I wouldn't even know where to start. Probably likes to cuddle. She could. That's who he could be. But that's just the first impression. I could be totally wrong. It's only a first impression. And no impression is strong. It never can hurt to question. No one can this will lead to romance. Sometimes the ones who seem great are a nightmare day. Either way, I've been burned by the one thing I Second glass, second glass, a second glass, it's worth a second glass.